this could be us So back to what I was saying This could be us Good morning, Miners. Welcome to the Diggins for Thursday, October 4th, 2018. Today is Decades Day. Seniors wear 80s, juniors wear 50s, sophomores wear 70s, and freshmen wear 60s. Friday is Neon Day, except for the theme for the football game is going to be blue and gold. October 1st through 4th, homecoming tickets are still on sale, but today is the last day. In the student store during lunch and after school till 345. $20 for NU students with a current NU school ID. Free tickets for students with ASB VIP cards. $25 guest pass tickets sold to NU students with pre-approved guest pass application on file. NU students must purchase their own ticket first. Only one guest per student, cash only. Are you interested in healthy relationships or just want to be heard by your peers? Well, Peer Advocates Club is the place for you. Come Thursdays at lunch to G14. Snacks will be provided. College Essay Workshop. Do you need some tips for the college essay? Turn your words into music, literally, at this afternoon workshop in support of the Nevada Union Band Department. On Sunday, October 7th from 2 to 4, Kim Colbertson will teach a workshop where she will help guide the creation of new essays and cover how to fine-tune a college essay in progress. Through short writing exercises, examples from successful essays, and a question-answer session, Kim will help students with the, both their main essay and those tricky short answer supplementary question essays. $20 donation to NU Band Boosters gets a seat up at the workshop. Girls soccer. We have a soccer meeting for any girls and their parents this Thursday. We'll meet in J105 at 7.30 p.m. Students should bring their Chromebooks. Interested in playing NU girls soccer? Come to our information night tonight. Here are some details. It's at 7.30 p.m., not 6.30. And it's in J105, which is Beth Kessler's room. It's for students and athletes to discuss upcoming events. Athletes, you need to bring your Chromebooks. See you there! Attention seniors, Financial A9 and Scholar Night will be held in the Don Bagot Theater tonight, October 4th at 6 p.m. Seniors and their parents are invited to see this informational meeting that will cover our district scholarship process as well as the FAFSA and, that can offer, and what it can offer to you. To all students who ride the bus, please make sure to have your student ID with you at all times and especially if you ride the bus. You must have your student ID to ride the bus. If you've lost your student ID card, you will need to get it replaced at the student store for $5. And now, today's sports report. Hey Miners, I'm Jordan and this is your sports report for October the 4th. Last Monday, the, J the JV boys water polo team lost to Ponderosa with a final score of 7-8. to eight. And today, the varsity's boys water polo team will be playing at El Dorado Union Mine Pool. In other sports report, girls golf ball team will be playing against Ponderosa at Alta Sierra afterwards, and the girls tennis team will be playing here at Nevada Union against Placer. And later today, the Nevada Union girls volleyball team will be playing against Placer here at Nevada Union. JV girls water polo team will uh, be playing at El Dorado and the Union Mine Pool. Finally, last tonight is the Frosh football team that will be playing against Oakmont. Good job to all of our teams playing this week, and we'll have the results of these upcoming events throughout the week. Let's send it back to the news. Hey sports fans, I'm here with my favorite little buddy, Jamie Wise, who runs the sports medicine program at Nevada Union. What a blessing on Nevada Union to have him and his crew here. Say hi to our trainers. You guys can go ahead and wave. Good deal. So I'm here to talk to you for a few minutes about um, fall sports. We're off to a great start. NU football placed uh, Friday night against Oakmont in our homecoming game. Tomorrow night, Nevada Union Volleyball hosts uh, Placer, and tennis is home tomorrow night. And man, we're just up to a great start in the Foothill Valley League. All our teams are very competitive. Come out and watch us. For winter sport athletes, make sure you sign up online registration with family ID and get your uh, sports physicals to our uh, assistant in the sports department, Debbie Short. And go Miners. The 
Ice Cream Social is the first band event of the year, and it will be held in the cafeteria on October 11th from 6 to 9 p.m. $5 donation for all-you-can-eat ice cream. This is your chance to see some great music and the marching band's winning field show before we take it into competition. Trust me, you won't want to miss out on that. Besides, how can you say no to all-you-can-eat ice cream? Students, now that you have student access on Synergy, please check your attendance to see if you need to clear up any or all-day absences. To avoid having the absences turn into cuts, please get them cleared up by tomorrow, October 5th. That's all for today, Miners. I'm Dawson. And I'm Braum. Have a great day.